Hello and welcome back to Caves of Code. Um, we had a pretty eventful episode in the last episode. Sorry. <laughs> we did Golgotha. Golgotha was uh, predictably hellish. Um, and I did die once. But uh, I did manage to clutch not get sick. So there is that. Um, we have Bethesda Sousa next, but we're not going to be going there for quite a long time. Um, I definitely want to do some things before I make my way over there. I think I kind of want to do the asphalt pits. Or maybe some more ruin diving. I was actually kind of enjoying, uh, the stuff we were seeing in the, in the last episode in our ruin dive. So I'm going to, I'm going to go check that out. I'm going to do some more, some more basic stuff over here. I do intend, by the way, to uh, get this is this is a legitimate playthrough uh, of Cud. Like I do want to get to the Moonstair. I have yet to actually see Moonstair legit, you know. So we're in dueling stance. I'm gonna try and swipe. We did manage to swipe their their business out of their hand. Oh, this is gonna be so good. Oh, that's not good. Chain turret. Okay, this is what we do here is oh i'm gonna go down and we're gonna pop up well we're gonna rest first lots of things happening here by the way looks like a, a sleeping uh slumberling just ate it oh something put up some uh there's a there's a turret tinker all right we're gonna pop up here and we're gonna swipe uh and we did disarm it perfect I don't know if we actually got to keep that though we, we are accruing some artifacts jacked laser rifle wow the fact that it's rifle uh jacked is quite nice we are gonna get some uh chem cells out of this as well we got some solar cells when did that happen we're gonna shove those into our recoilers oh we got a lot of solar cells actually Perfect. Solar cells are perfect for recoilers because you don't tend to need them very often. Oh, we've got another chain turret. Um, please swipe. There we go. Uh, did we disarm them? I think we did. <clears throat> I don't know where those weapons are ending up. I love the the laser beam animation okay swipe did we disarm it yes we did perfect and we're good pretty sure we're done here for the most part there is some uh living creepers i'm just gonna oh we're already done i mean the chain herd i think is already better by far We have a slumberling. Do we want to disturb the slumberling? I don't think we do. Ouch. Swipe. We disarmed them. Nice. Chain laser turret. Yeah. That was a chain laser turret. Kind of nasty. Oh god, we've got a saw hander. Um, they're not affected by sleep gas, so we're just gonna use our chain turret and then uh, I actually didn't mean to do that, but I'm gonna use my stunning force There we go, perfect I'll Rest up head back down Finish uh, this guy off who managed to uh, evade death For a short period we're gonna switch to aggressive stance just so that I can pen them more easily Perfect. It's all going according to plan. Um, I'm grabbing the good stuff. We got some more artifacts. Let's have a look at those. Salty oil jacked chain laser. Oh, 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 oh. oh well, that's uh, kind of a massive improvement, isn't it? Um, 
Yeah, let's wield that. <laughs> and we have a high capacity solar cell and a metered cell and a lead acid cell. Good stuff. Really, really excellent stuff right now. Um, did we unequip our chain? Is that a chain laser rifle or a pistol? Oh, it's a heavy weapon. Oh, I think we actually... Are we not heavy weapons? We might not be. Uh, I don't think we are. But it might be a good idea. We could go heavy weapon. It would be a lot of fun. I haven't really been able... Uh, had a chance to, to try that. Okay, we're gonna swipe this lad. Um, we did disarm him, so cool. Oh, this is this is already amazing. We're not even like one floor down in this business and we've already got like a chain laser gun. There's something over there doing some pretty nasty damage. I think it's a chain gun. Lead slug. I think that's just a chain turret. Oh, that's not good. Okay, we don't necessarily need to mess with what's over there. So we're just gonna head down. I'm gonna go down one more floor and then we might um, bail out. What was that? It's another chain turret. Swipe. Uh, what is that? Is confusion gas and a maze beard. Not really a huge fan of that. Okay, we, we did kill the maze beard. We are over encumbered now, unfortunately. Let's just go ahead and uh, rest. Oh God. Uh, we're hampered, overburdened. Um, I don't think they got our hand. I need to, like, drop some stuff, obviously. Let's do a stunning force. Okay, that buys us some time. I'm gonna... I'm gonna look at this real quick just to get the reputation or whatever it is. I kind of want to drop it, but I kind of want to keep it as well. I don't know if we have anything else we can drop. We have too many books right now is really the main problem. Uh, we definitely don't need all of these jacked laser rifles. <sighs> Seems a shame to drop them. I'd, I'd like to disassemble them as well. But I don't have enough time. Alright, we're gonna drop this. We're gonna drop the 40 pound thing. Ouch. I'm gonna try and swipe them, um, them, like disarm them. Okay, we killed them. That could have been really bad. All right, we're gonna rest. Oh God, we've got that slug lad. Um, okay, yeah, laser turret, chain laser turret's gonna do it. That acid is really a bummer. Okay, we've got a dervish of the sightless way. I'm not leaving without some stuff. Um, so let's go ahead and disassemble some of this stuff. I don't know if we get the cells. Do we get the energy, the chem cells? I think we do. It doesn't matter. We're already like reaching critical mass with that stuff. We're going to treat these as scrap, by the way. We're going to examine this painted chain gun. It's just a basic chain gun. That's probably pretty good. I don't know if it's as good as a chain laser turret though. It is a heavy weapon, accuracy low. Um, we'll disassemble it. Grab the blood slugs, I guess. All right, and I'm I'm gonna count my blessings and get out of here.
There are hostiles nearby. Oh, I guess it's counting the slumberling. Okay. Um, that was pretty good. I, I enjoyed that. Let's, um, let's, maybe we could recoil to grit gate. Kind of want to just go to Bela just to, oh God, please don't say we're lost. Oh God, we're lost. What the heck is this business? How, look, listen, listen. How are you going to do that to me, cud? How could you, how, how could you, honestly? You're lost and you could not possibly be more screwed. <laughs> I honestly don't think there's anything else that if there was maybe a slug snout on there, just, to, just to like twist the blade, that would be kind of funny. But also what does hampered mean? Oh, I guess, oh, let's move speed while we're carrying a heavy weapon. Um, okay. We're going to do get yeah, sleep gas. And a traipsing mortar. Are you kidding me right now? Um, stunning force. We did manage to stun like everything. Um, start precognition. Defensive stance. Swipe. I don't think that that did it. We're just, we're going to have to shoot our way out. Our cell is pretty low in our gun. We are blowing through these livid creepers. I am, uh, I am really appreciating this laser turret right now this laser chain gun no i actually think we're good i think we're good on uh, on our precognition my god that was good so we are in ruins i am actually i'm gonna like may as well like take out the rest of this place i love the turning to dust animation so much so so much Oh, I accidentally took on a slumberling. That was a mistake. Um, going to go ahead and shield slam them. Uh, release some gas. Stunning force. Continue shooting them. We took out a slumberling. Feels good. We also leveled up. Let's see. I, I have a bunch of mutation points. We should throw those in carapace. So we can go only go as high as nine. Um, I think we should start throwing points into sleep gas generation. I think that I think I think that that will help a lot. Um. Is there anything else we can get in long blade on guard maybe lunge and swipe have no cooldown i don't think i've taken lunge oh we need more agility for lunge aggressive stance lunge through an empty space at an opponent and attack at plus two penetration you must move through in an empty space defensive stance attack an opponent then lunge backwards two spaces dueling stance attack an opponent at plus one pen, the attack is guaranteed to hit and penetrate at least once. Okay, dueling stance sounds really good. Lunge sounds really good. I, I like the sound of lunge. Scrunge. I don't, I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't know, to be honest. Um, we apparently do have pistol. I kind of want to take heavy weapon. Heavy weapon counts count for half their weight toward your encumbrance. I don't know if that means we still get negative 25 speed. You suffer no movement penalty while wielding a heavy weapon. So we can negate that. 
You fire five shots with your heavy weapon sweeping over a 90 degree cone. I'm gonna go heavy weapon. I think that this is the perfect weapon for us, honestly. It helps that we got a really good weapon. But also, like, you don't you you don't need accuracy when you can just sweep. Um now nah, we'll just use up the chem cell. I am gonna need a lot of chem cells. We will likely make enemies with uh, people when I don't want to. I'm comfortable with this. We're getting a lot of XP right now. 400 for the slugs, 162 for uh, the acid ants, whatever they are. Ooh, what is this? 31. Oh, it's a freeze ray. And it's got some kind of uh, weird chem cell in it. In it. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry I'm like this. In it. Alright. Um, life sap. Life sap is dead. Oh, this is so satisfying. I'm having, I'm having so much fun right now. It doesn't hurt that, uh... This weapon's got one of the new animations, so it just it just looks amazing. Plaster for gloves. <clears throat> Those are fine. I think they're worth something. Oh, a floating glow sphere. Now that's a good find. Um, stasis grenade. That's quite nice. You are famished. Okay, let's eat some food. Plus eight hit points for the rest of the day. That's a nice one. I'm cool with that. Um, so we're just kind of, we're just going to do some ruin diving. Um, nothing too spicy. I guess there's no reason why I, I'm using a gun right in front of them. So let's, uh, we are in... We're poisoned by gas. That's not good. They're very close to death. I'm going to switch to aggressive stance. Oh, we might die. Jesus. And we have... We don't have good... Um, oh, God. I, I'm probably going to die, actually. I overestimated myself somewhat. Okay, we are recovering. I'm gonna go ahead and throw down some sleep gas and then sleep <laughs> Rest That was almost really bad Oh, we have a electric snail flail Let's um, let's disarm them Dueling stance Disarm We did not disarm them. Okay, switch to aggressive stance for the extra pen. They do quite a lot of damage because they do electric damage and it just goes through armor. There we go. As I understand it, there is a corpse on the ground. Um, do we have enough to take butchery? Let's take butchery. You butcher the electric snail corpse into an electric snail shell. I'm pretty sure that's, like, really good. It's a really good helmet. Yeah. So that's two AV. We just got an extra AV there. Fantastic. All right, let's... Actually, I don't want to head down just yet. I, I, I'm, I'm not feeling super healthy right now. There we go. We're in an aggressive stance. We are hampered. That's fine. Oh god. What a horrible way to encounter something like that. Um, stun them. Push them away. Uh, precognition. 
and fire away. Ow. Would you like to return to the start of your vision? Yes. Okay, so, you know, uh, that's why I do that. It's so that I can run away. The problem is, is that they are faster than me right now because of my reduced movement. It's the one problem with this uh, heavy weapons business. We can try and shield slam them. Ow, good lord, that sucks. Okay, we're going to sprint. Help me, albino ape that I didn't see last time. Where are you? Where did it go? Oh god, why did I have to go looking for it? It keeps like disappearing. Come on, at least hit it. That is like the least you can do. Um Dueling stance. Swipe. It's not gonna do it. Stunning force. I died. I deserve that. I deserve that death. Oh, that really sucks. I was I was finding some good stuff there, and we got a lot of XP from all those livid creepers, and I I just had to go and push my luck, didn't I? Oh, we don't have the laser. Wow, I really messed up, didn't I? I really messed up. Well, I can't let this stand. I have to go get that again. I there's I'm sorry. That's that is that that really sucks. Um I'm I'm going to attempt to find it again. Really really not pleased with myself right now. What we will do is I'm going to take um Butchery again and see if we can't kill the snail flail Okay, and dueling stance swipe, I don't think we can disarm a Creature that is using like natural weapons like this We'll switch to aggressive stance and do our best there we go and we did manage to get ourselves a snail corpse. So we'll equip that. Rest. I don't know what... Resonance Miner. Uh, resonance is pretty nasty, actually. What is this? Fusion Pumping Station. With algal water. I don't know what happened to... Oh, there it is. They keep disappearing on me. Like, something I should see just seems to disappear right in front of me. Alright, well this isn't it though. Um, this is not the location I, I, I had... Oh. There's a resonance mine. Um, we're gonna examine that. Try and disarm it. Take it, um... Jacked laser rifle. Well, we did get a jacked laser rifle. I don't, it's just, I don't have the, the... Wait, maybe I do have it. If I have the, um... No, I don't. If I, if I had the, 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 um, laser machine gun, then I would feel a little bit better. Uh, we're gonna treat these as scrap and disassemble. I'm also going to dis uh, disassemble my shotgun, I guess. I'm on the hunt now. I need to find... I need to find that uh, chain turret. Laser chain turret. Okay, there it is. We found it.
So we're going to swap to dueling stance. And we actually, this is a better way to find it than before. Go in. Um, I disarmed it. All right, cool. And it's on the ground. Oh, please. Why? Okay, we need to kill this lad now. Aggressive stance. Just a random seed sower goat folk hanging out. Perfect. Okay, we we succeeded. Um, is this this is the object chain jack chain laser? Perfect. We we got it back. Oh man. Let's not blow it now. We've got um, go folk here. There's probably a legendary go folk around the corner. I'm going to start a precognition now. And um, sleep gas. Stunning force. Yeah, that works. Uh, I guess we don't have to be doing that. We don't have to use the, the good, like the cool gun always, you know? No, so we're good. I, the precognition is a good way for me to kind of gauge how tough a battle is. Shield slam, knockout gas. And, um, let's see, dueling stance, swipe. I disarmed them. Perfect. There's a feathered nylon body pack. I think I can wear that? Yes, I can. That's amazing. Okay, we actually, we're getting, like, even better stuff. We found another salt hopper mandible. That is amazing. Um, still not good as good as our folded carbide longsword, but still. Oh, I don't have a glow sphere anymore. Uh, our floating glow sphere. That was another thing I lost. Okay, well, at least we have another thing, to, another mission, reason to come back here. Um, there is chain gauntlets on the ground. I think those are better than what we're wearing. We have steel gauntlets. But we have boar skin gloves, so that's actually a benefit. Dagger on the ground. Um, do, are these better than what we're wearing? Feet. Uh, chain boots. I think chain boots are even better. They're about the same. Okay, let's come back over here and rest. Okay, things are looking up. We have a somewhat different situation than we we had last time. Swipe whatever they have out of their hand. We didn't manage to. Um, aggressive stance. Actually, let's just like, again. Sleep gas. Stunning blow. And then fire. And this is a, like a really good combo. It, it gets everyone away from me. And then also stuns them in theory. So, you know, like, uh, they're just there and I have a little bit of distance so I can actually like fire my gun on them. Also gives me like a little safety net in case, um, like, I'm in danger, or I sense danger, so, like, because they won't walk into, uh, into the gas. There's a, just, it's just, like, a really good build. Uh, it'll be even better when I don't lose, uh, we got our floating glow sphere back. When I, oh, another folded carbide longsword. Amazing. How, we're getting, like, simultaneously very lucky, and then I'm, like, squandering these gifts. I think I should just head back to Great Gate now. Um... It's, it's a good build. 
it's working out um i i it took a it took a bit for me to figure out how to make it work but i i'm liking this a lot okay we're gonna go back to grid gate we're also gonna replace I, unfortunately those are not replaced by with solar cells anymore replace with solar cell and replace with solar cell okay so um good things have happened in this episode if you are enjoying this series definitely hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this i'll see you guys next time take it easy